The start of summer is seen as a happy time for students, but not all children can celebrate the end of school. For some, school is one of the few places they can eat a warm meal. But as Valley News Team's Veronica Marshall finds out, when school closes down, the community steps up. As students board buses and say goodbye, and schools look forward to winding down for the summer. Bye, other places are ramping up for a busy season because while students can take the summer off, hunger doesn't. Some of our busiest times is in the summertime because parents have kids at home during the summer. They're wanting snacks and they're wanting lunches and so our food pantries are busier. Some of these sites are serving up to 40 kids a day. Nancy Caraview works at the Great Plains Food Bank and says providing summer meals for kids is a must. It's a need she understands personally. There's been times where when I first had my first kid that we were on SNAP and we were there's days where we maybe didn't know if we needed to go use a food pantry. The food bank more than doubled its number of summer meal sites this year, and it isn't the only one stepping in to help. Last year, we served over 95,000 meals to kids. Tons of kids come in and they eat for free, and they come in every day knowing that they can get a free meal. The women say their programs let kids act like kids and enjoy their time off instead of worrying about where their next meals are coming from. The kids are allowed to come in. They can play with the kids on the playground. If there's an activity inside the gym or anything after lunch, they're allowed to participate in that as well. And if I can just play that part in making sure that they feel um, feel cared for and that they're not any different than me or anyone else standing around them, that makes it's huge for me. So while the programs are busy now, they say they're happy to step up until school starts again. In Fargo, Veronica Marshall, Valley News Live. For a complete list of all the summer meals programs in our area and the services they offer, like senior meals and free farmers market, visit our website, valleynewslive.com.